Well, we're back out in the garage. Um, kind of wrapped up projects for the mini snowcat this year. But uh, I have another pretty uh, significant project up and coming. And uh, while I have a little bit of time, I figured I would get uh, a couple little jigs out of the way that will be required for that project. And um, here we are. So that upcoming project is going to involve a whole bunch of inch and a half schedule 40 uh, pipe and I'm gonna have to drill a bunch of holes through that pipe uh, and normally if it was a shorter section something like this it'd be easy to clamp into the mill and drill and uh, get a nice uh, square hole so it's not offset or off kilter but uh, a lot of those pipes are gonna be uh, a good a good length uh, so I'd say some of them will be 20 plus feet long and need holes drilled periodically along the length so putting them into the mill and drill is not feasible and so the solution I've come up for with that is to build a little jig. So the plan here I have a piece of angle and I've already uh, milled a flat spot along the kind of peak of the uh, angle and the idea here is that um, I'm going to use this big chunk of three-quarter inch uh, flat bar. I'm going to put it onto that flat there, clamp it and weld it. And then basically, uh, once it's all said and done, uh, take and drill uh, nice and square so it's not going to be off on any of the axis and uh, drill the hole that we need and use this as a jig so that eventually uh, when I clamp it to the pipe it will keep my drill aligned and it'll give us a nice square and true hole so I'm gonna make um, a jig for round I also need to do a similar jig that will be used for uh, square tubing because there will be a whole bunch of holes to be drilled into that as well and having them uh, drilled properly is quite important to the assembly of the project so Gonna get going on this and uh, get this uh, completed. Okay, well, I have my jig here clamped in place. So the next step is to uh, weld along both sides. Uh, and then once it's cooled, we will set this up in the uh, mill and drill and we can drill a nice true hole. It'll be square to the uh, the piece of angle there and that'll assist with us uh, drilling those nice and straight holes. So I have the welding done on the two parts of the jigs. So this jig here is for a two inch by two inch square tubing. And uh, basically I used a piece of angle on that side, angle on that side, nice thick piece of three eighths uh, plate on there. And then this is what we're gonna drill through with uh, a 5 16 uh, drill bit. And basically that's going to make sure that as we go through the material, it's nice and square to the tube and uh, everything lines up really nicely. Uh, and then same idea-ish for the, the round pipe uh, drill jig. Uh, in this case here, uh, basically I welded this big chunk of stock onto the angle there and really at this point you can, it's still kind of hot, but you'll be able to uh, square it up straight so I like clamp the, the round pipe in place and then basically always make sure that when this gets clamped onto it that it's actually sitting uh, perpendicular and again when we go to drill through all the holes are going to be uh, perfectly uh, aligned 
uh, on access to the material. So the step now is to, to take this and that one, uh, put them into the vise on the mill and drill and basically drill those, uh, those holes. Well, here are our two jigs. They are basically uh, ready to go. I did a test drill and they, uh, they work really well. Um, make drilling a true hole through some of that material easy and these are gonna be put to some pretty serious use in the next couple weeks. But uh, for now, yeah, it's been uh, a good little project getting things in order and uh, that's about it. Thanks for watching.